Good morning, Yala. Totins. Mm -mm. I'm not saying goodbye. Good morning, Yala Mensa. I hope Yala is serech. I guess I don't know why I'm speaking in Afrikaans. I was watching Auntie T yesterday, last night. <laughs> so, all our beautiful people, it's Nona here. If you don't know, it's the Nona Nation. Hope you guys are good. I am good. I am blessed and highly favored. I hope you guys are good. I'm good. Um, good morning, guys. On day 26 today, I need to do my laundry. I am leaving on Tuesday. Wait, when is the... The 29th is on Sunday. So the 30th is on Monday. I'm leaving on Tuesday. So yeah, I need to do my laundry. The sun is out. Let me show you. It's not going to focus. But yeah, as you can see, the sun is out. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I need to do my laundry. Let's get back. Let's get. Ooh, I look nice. <laughs> my skin is giving. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, I need to do my laundry. And yeah, I need to prepare because I'm leaving next week, Tuesday. So early in the morning, the early hours of the morning. Not in Datawusa, but in the morning. I think I'm leaving around 9. My bus is scheduled for 9. So obviously I need to get there an hour before. So yeah, let me do my laundry. And yeah, I'll catch you guys. Wait, I need to do my bed first. And then I'll take out my stuff for laundry. Because right now it's 8. Um, it's 8. Mm, it's quarter past 8. So, yeah. I wanted to wake up at 7. But, yeah. I was doing a late shift yesterday. You guys know. So, this week is my late shift. So, yeah. Let us go and do this dirty laundry. Doom. Dirty laundry, this dirty laundry. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm gonna catch you later. Okay, I'm not even gonna show you when I'm doing my bed. I feel like I've been doing it this whole vlog. So, this whole not this whole vlog, <laughs> this whole um, 30 days challenge. So, I'm not even gonna show you guys when I'm doing my bed, but yeah. Just know what I am doing my bed. You know how I do my bed, so yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna catch you later. Okay. Okay, let's go. But <sighs> four. No money left. it pisses me off because I did call them and told them can I cancel the insurances I guess God is all to say mm -hmm. pump the brakes girl oof but David ordered just four of them is a scam guys oh. two at least if I had I wish I could go back to the good old days where I was still scared of doing this um remember they used to say sorry guys at the background I told you guys I'm doing laundry remember in the old mm, not in the old days remember they would say especially your parents are the ones who were always I'm giving you this advice they would say hey build a credit score so you can be able to like open um, accounts and stuff so at least they'll track me I was really really scared of doing this thing I told myself I was like I'm not doing all these things hi as life went I first opened e 
because I didn't have a credit score, I needed to buy a phone. So I didn't want to do my clothing and stuff. I was never, even right now, I'm not a fan of clothes. I'm just being held by Big Blue because we get clothing allowance and stuff. But yeah, if it wasn't for that, I'm not a huge fan of clothing. So I ended up opting for, um, what's the name? I ended up opting to open an account for a phone. And then I did that because I didn't have a credit score. I needed to like pay up front a bit of a half of the phone that I was getting. And then, yeah, I got approved and then I've been paying it. I've been paying it nicely for those whole two years. And then I did build my credit uh, record. And then time went. I needed to buy my car, my mom's car. So we were actually going to split, split the car with my brother. So I was like, you know what? I'm in Cape Town. I really need this car. So I ended up doing it alone. And then my bills went up. <laughs> this loan is having me by a neck. I just cannot wait for three years. Three more years and then I'm done with it. Because you're, you and your ain't bambila. If, it's, if it wasn't for that, I would have left this house. I would have, by the time when I moved back from Cape Town, I would have just stayed maybe for six months and then find my own place. But it's just this loan. Once this loan is done, I pray that God's grace leads me and show me a perfect apartment that I will move in. Yeah. But once this loan is done, I am moving out. If everything is paid, I am moving out. Guys, yeah. Life is for the living. Yeah, foster, as my dad would say, we forced so a good force, not to play as good as it come up, but yeah, okay, enough about that. You guys know my business now, but yeah, <laughs> there's other stuff that you guys don't know, but yeah, this one I just had to like ish, voice it out because hey, 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 hey. Building a credit score, hey. But at least it's just that major loan one. But once it's done, I'm a free woman. The next three years, I'm done with it. I'm drinking e it's not nice. I'm drinking warm water. It has um what's the name of this thing? Apple cider vinegar and chives. I drink it on an empty stomach, it helps. Uh, I'll get back to you guys. I need to take this laundry out. I'll be back. <laughs>
beautiful people. Hey guys, I hope you look good. I'm good. I just got home. As you saw earlier, I was busy packing the laundry that I washed. Guys, it's a bit crazy in there. I know I don't like showing you guys, but it's a bit crazy. Just <laughs> I need to sort that out. It's all washed to stuff. So, never mind, those are my toiletries. I need to sort this place out. I never want to show you the. I need to sort that out. So, yeah, all the laundry is washed. So, yeah, I just need to go wash my face. My face has a bit of sand. Today it was dusty. So, yeah, I need to wash my face. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah guys, I'm going to be closing the vlog right now. From my heart to yours, I hope you have a beautiful and blessed day. And please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also leave a nice comment down below. Um, yeah, so I'm going to see you then. Bye for now on day 26. Bye guys.